Hi folks and welcome to a slightly different video. This is all about you guys. Thank you very much for 2000 subscribers, which is absolutely nuts. It's um hasn't been long since we were at the 1k and even that I thought was mind boggling and now we're sitting at 2k. It's it's quite nice, put it that way. So yeah, this is just a thank you. You guys are absolute legends. We're going to need a, a number of vehicles to fit us all in if we ever do or go on a holiday together. Um, yeah, not sure who's paying for that. If you're a millionaire out there, let us all go on holiday together. Um, but yeah, so this is just a little background clip because this is another video where I need your help. Now, my internet has gone from this speed, which is poor to this speed which is slightly better um it's been a long time coming since i lived in this house and started this i've always been dealing with poor internet and when i have streamed on the very rare occasions i've had to stream on twitch because the bit rate is uh, a little bit more kind to lower internet let's say but now basically i've got full near as damn gigabit internet so it's going to make my life a lot lot easier as we get taken out how nice was that Look at me being a good sportsman there and waiting. Uh, yeah, <laughs> getting completely sidetracked. Um, so yeah, where do I stream is my question to all of you that watch my content. Where do you want me to stream? There, I do have a preference. I would like to stream on a certain platform. Not going to mention what that is. But the basic advantages are obviously Twitch you know, is slightly better for streaming. There's more to do and get involved with chat and things like that. But saying that, you know, being a sub on Twitch and a sub on YouTube is a bit of a, an annoyance that they're two separate ones. Obviously, there is good that it has competition, but Twitch can only really, for fast-paced games like that, really stream decently at 1080p. You can't really go any higher than that because the bitrate cap at the moment, if I'm wrong and that's changed since the last time I looked, which is only about three or four months ago, then let me know. But YouTube, technically, the bit rate I can chuck out to the internet will be a lot, lot higher. So I'm thinking I can stream at 1440p. So that would be a little bit nicer that you'll get a little bit more uh, eye candy. I mean, you have to look at this mug, but it'll be a little bit more eye candy. So there's pros and cons of both. So I'm putting it out there. I do have a personal preference that I'm hoping everyone votes for. <laughs> um, but if you want me to stream on the other one, then at the end of the day, your guy's watching it what do you want that's all i'm asking for um so yeah pop it down in the comments which one's which and as i say a big big thank you to each and every one of the subs to this a uh, big thank you to channel members as well because it's one of the things i don't know where youtube's going to go but uh, you know it, my, my channel membership is the lowest it can be it's 99p because i don't know what i can give that you know really gives advantage if i can upload a video early for the track guides then i will do that because that's that's to me is an easy one to do um but i don't want to be one of these guys that has like 99p and you get this and five pound you get this and seven and ten pounds i've seen channel memberships out there for like 60 quid a month i mean who, who is uploading to youtube think they're worth 60 pound a month that's completely bonkers to me um but yeah who knows where this little train ride is going to go uh, and i want to try and include you guys as much as possible hence why i annoy you with all these questions so yeah ultimately where should i stream if and when I stream. I'm thinking of streaming practice sessions. Maybe I stream when I actually do the track guides, which will be a little bit advanced because I technically do it on a Monday night for the following Tuesday. So say if we're week one, I'll be doing track guide for week three because week two would already be done. Something like that. But it's up in the air. Obviously, the big 24-hour races that we do, we'll be streaming them. Might stream a few practice sessions. Maybe we can do some setup work together if we've got the same car who knows what's going to happen but yeah question please and answers well i'm not question i'm asking the question answers below where do you want me to stream twitch or youtube thank you very much for watching thank you for 2k and uh yeah on to 2022